Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I'm DC Vlogs, and today we're going to be looking at the uh, last Bring Arts figure in my collection. So today this is Terra. He's another one of my favorite Keyblade wielders, which makes up the seven in my collection for the Guardians of Light. So Terra's uh, nothing really special. He's got ab crunch there, as you can tell. Uh, the same articulation as all the other characters. He comes with his Ends of the Earth Keyblade. Or, what was it? Uh, yeah, the end, uh, Endsworth Keyblades that he's known for using. He's got the armor, which allows him to transform into his Keyblade War armor. So there's that. He also has a couple extra heads and, and hands, head sculpts. So we'll show that here. So here we have Terra's Keyblade here. So it's really nicely de detailed. It's got that sapphire metallic blue there. Browns and the golds. So we'll put Terra aside for a second so I can show you the, ha the extra hands and stuff. So he's going to come with a total of uh, five different hands. As if I can find them. Yeah, so, so Terra's got two keyblade hold. He's got two keyblade holding hands. One for the end of the earth. So you got here's the fists here, which come defaulted on the figure, and then these two extra hands here. You got these two open hands for that, and you also get two extra head sculpts with Terra, along with his other keyblade. You got the closed eye look, where he's kind of like a meditating kind of uh, head sculpt. And you also get the Terranort head sculpt, which is really cool. Which you can, I think you can also use for uh, Young Xehanort as well. If you want to make a custom Bring Arts figure using the Axle Body or Roxas, however you want to do it. So there's that head. Nicely done. with Again, with the silver silver and whitish hair. Hair kind of pearlescent look there. And then this is the one keyboard I was telling you guys about. Really nicely done. It's... The Goat of Atonement Keyblade, or Master Xehanort's Keyblade, as it was called in the Ultimania book. So we got that. So you've got the eye in the crest above there. You've got the eye down there. And it said the eye is uh, to belong to the Master of Masters in the uh, Dark Seeker Saga, as we heard from Kingdom Hearts 3. So there, we've seen a bunch of different characters with this, like the mysterious um, master and Unicross, um, Zigbar's um, Zigbar has wielded it, and uh, the master's uh, or the apprentice of the master has wielded. It. I forgot what the master name is, but you get the general idea. Um, so yeah, that's gonna be doing it for this review. Thank you guys again for. All the support and likes on this video and be sure to follow me for more content coming soon and um yeah so peace out